And we begin here tonight with those new developments in our I-Team investigation into those Kia vehicles going up in flames. Kia and Hyundai now both issuing new recalls for more than a half million vehicles. And tonight, I-Team reporter Jackie Calloway is here, the first to expose hundreds of these car fires here in the studio with the impact on local drivers. Jackie? Well, according to these documents that we pulled off the government's website, Kia and Hyundai are recalling three different SUV models for defects, which could cause the vehicles to go up in flames. Now, that includes the Kia Soul, the same car that burned up in a Cincinnati parking lot in 2017, killing the driver. It's an acknowledgement by Kia, which as of just a few months ago was saying they couldn't find anything wrong with the Kia Soul. Now, the Center for Auto Safety petitioned federal regulators last summer to investigate fires in Kia Souls. The watchdog says there have been 40 unexplained Kia Soul fires so far. Now, Kia is recalling more than 300,000 2012 to 2016 Souls over a defect with the catalytic converter, which could cause a fire. The I-Team has exposed hundreds of vehicle fires since last year, including some caused by fuel leaks after faulty engine recall work. Now, this recall also includes the 2011 and 2012 Kia Sportage models and Hyundai's 2011 to 2013 Tucson, both for oil pan leaks that could start a fire. The Korean automakers already recalled thousands of vehicles in January over fire dangers. Today's announcement brings the recall total to nearly 700,000 vehicles this year alone.